Okay. Okay. Let's get started. First recording. New headset. New game. Hey, let's see what happens here. Firstly, always check the downloaded content. Want to see what might be new. Oh, we do have a few new things since yesterday. Silo King... I don't really need this at the moment. Mm, seems more than what I need. I might need it later. $21,700. It doesn't tell me the spreading width. Oh, there it is, 18 meters. Uh, it's okay. Flegel DPW pack. Oh, this looks interesting. And 15 to 42 meters. Fertilizer and lime. Now I'm liking that, so I'm going to go ahead and install this. Um, the brettle. Fertilizer and lime. I like dual combination. Amazon four meter cedar. I don't have a lot of details here. Uh, I'm not so much interested in the. Okay, water tank. So this is interesting. I think I'm going to install this one. High pressure washer. I do want to install this one. Uh, vehicle workshop ramps. So I've got another setup for my workshop right now. I think I'm going to keep it. Liquid support. Trailers in this package will help you to transport liquids. Choice of color. 15,000. Capacity 8,000 liters. Two configurations, fertilizers and herbicides, diesel, hmm, I don't really think I need this one. Okay, the free landscape tools, I wish I had more information about this one. Uh, there are times when I want to pay, and there are times when I think free is better. So I'm going to hold off for now. Beware of straw. Yeah, I'm not interested. I'm not doing bales right now. Where's the specs? No specs? No, because I'm going to come back in here. Uh, I thought I had specs on that. Yeah, maybe this is something that Giants needs to patch. Where am I, Where's my information? Okay. Well, let's go ahead and install this. Um, I don't really don't really need something this massive at this point in time. Maybe in the future I'll be interested. These trailers. I'm not doing bales right now. Now I think we're about to get the No Man's Land map. At which point I definitely will want the free landscaping tools because there's going to be a lot of work to do on that map. All right, seems good. Expecting some more. Um, I just deselect all and reselect all, fast and easy, and start. So my gameplay style is a little, I don't know. I'm sure everybody's game 
play style is a little bit unique. And my gameplay style is some things I want uh, more realism. Um, you know, I'm not into money cheats. If uh, there's a bug and I don't get paid for the uh, harvesting contract <laughs> that I just completed, then I'm going to add some money in. Um, but I'm not into money cheats so much. Um, I don't mind taking out a loan and managing the loan. The way I've got it figured is, you know, um, the bigger and better farm you have, the more loan you should be able to take out. So the current cap on a $500,000 loan seems a bit too low for me. But, um, you know, there's some mods coming that will address that. All right. We are loaded. Here we are. Oh, yes. I left everything out. Didn't put it away. Picked up this sweet ride the other day. So you can tell I've got my radio on right now. I'm going to have to turn it off for these recordings. But uh, the way I like to play the radio when I'm not recording is, uh, you know, I think of it as like an iPod or a, you know, modern day, you're going to have earbuds in your ears. doesn't matter whether you're sitting in the tractor or not. Um, because, you know, you're going to have your ear pods in and you're going to be listening to music. Uh, let's go here. And let's turn this. Where's the radio? Radio, 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 radio off um anyway you're gonna be wandering around with your earbuds in you're not listening to some old radio on the tractor that only plays when you're inside the tractor you're you're listening to your earbuds you're um streaming your music from whatever music service that you uh enjoy all right so let's uh let's hop in here start up the engine now one of the things I like to do you'll notice my uh, cruise control is set at 9 miles per hour I can uh, bump that up a little bit here but uh, I like to set the cruise control low on my farm truck um, I expect I'll have other cars that will zip around town a lot faster in but uh, general, generally, my farm truck needs to be able to cruise around here. And uh, I don't want to, you know, jam through the town too fast. All right, so my chickens. Huh? No health. No food. Oh, my God. We got to take care of that right now. All right, let's get over here. get a tractor and a trailer looks like I got a trailer parked right there let's hop in here disconnect yeah everybody keeps commenting on these sounds and I'll tell you what they're they're incredible done a hell of a job at getting these sounds dialed in pretty sweet deal all right the way I got this thing set up right now uh, I'll do a farm tour later but I moved my uh, moved my silo a little bit out of the way from the main yard um, it seems I got my uh, what do you call it? Turned off. Okay, let's fill that up with some sorghum, the 100% efficient food source for your uh, farm chickens. I am waiting for the. Um, oh, we want to head back over here. I am waiting for the mod for the 
better cab view. Uh, looks like we cut that a little too close. Swing it wider. What do we got going on here? Caught up. It didn't quite allow enough room when I put all this stuff in. I do, I do very much like the uh, setup that I've got here, but it is tight. All right, chickens are fed. Oh, running into stuff. All right, here we go. Let's go uh, dump the rest of this sorghum off. Everything we didn't use. There we go. I still need my help window. I know it's in the way, but we're going to... We're going to deal with it. Yeah, it seems the mods are coming out fast and heavy recently. I, uh, I know that there's well over 500 mods currently in testing. They're up to six days on the, uh, well, five, five or six days. I don't know. I think I saw six days. Uh, testing time. All right, I'm not putting everything away right now. We're just going to park right here and shut it down. Now, I am not super realism in my playing. So if I've got a tractor right here, I'll walk over and jump into it. But otherwise, I'm going to pop around and find what I need. Now, let's go check on those chickens. Sorry, chickens. I really screwed that one up. All right, so health is zero, but we got food. Are there 360 of you? Huh? Did we get maxed out on chickens? I think we may have. Oh, uh, super cool. Uh, we could sell some of these old chickens. Uh, we need to get their health up. Maximize the money. Ah, here come the eggs. Oh, I got some eggs stuck in the ground. I gotta figure out how to fix that. Um, all right. So today, oh, squirrely. I need to adjust this controller a little bit still. All right, this park's right here. Eventually, I'm gonna get a get a garage, but I don't have it right now. Now we're going to walk. Nope. I don't have one. Hmm. We are going to have to go rent a harvester. What do you think of this paint color? It's a metallic black on the bottom. And I don't know what you call this color. A metallic deep dark brown or something on the top. I think it looks all right. Cruising 74 miles an hour down the 30 mile an hour street. Always fun. Whoa. A little too tight there. Buy myself this uh, tanker. Used. Have nothing to tow it with yet, but just couldn't pass the, pass the deal up. It was a sweet buy. Oh, so we got a harvester. I can't afford it. I got $84,000 in the, in the bank. $84,000 in the bank. Did I already buy? I think I already bought the oil mill because I'm harvesting canola. 
All right, I can't afford that, can't afford that. What is this? We got here a planter. Mm, six meter planter. Maize, sunflowers, or soybeans. So I'm definitely going to get into sunflowers. I want to make some sunflower oil. But, oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Not, not yet. Do we have, no, only four items right now. Okay. Let's pop up here. Now, my fields aren't huge. I don't need a giant harvester. Harvesters are expensive to lease. For example, this one right here, which it seems I can get a five meter header. Um, five meter header, but this one right here is going to cost me $3,800 to lease. And by the time, by the time I lease the header, it's another $1,200. So we're looking at more than $5,000 to lease this. And if we bump up here to the top liner, it's 6,600 just for the harvester. Okay, so I've rented this one before. It's fine for my field size, so I'm gonna go ahead and lease it. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. I have $84,000 and this is 75. That's gonna break the bank. So I got 9,000, uh, can't afford it, but I could lease it. Could buy the harvest. No, 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 no. Talking myself, trying to talk myself into it. I don't want this harvester. I don't, I mean, I don't want to own it. So let's pop in here. Let's lease this thing. And we're going to need the header. And let's go ahead and lease the header as well. Here we go. Let's start this bad boy up. Get this header put on. Pop in the cab. Oh, yeah, I don't like I don't like driving with that header in front of my view. So let's go ahead and put the cruise control on. Maximum speed of 13 miles per hour. And head on back to the farm. When I initially started the game here, I uh, took out a $500,000 loan. I sold most everything that was on the farm um, and uh, then used that money to set things up the way I wanted and buy some additional equipment. So I still have I still have four hundred seventy thousand dollars in a loan here, and I need to whittle that down. Um, so initially, I was using some helpers. Initially, I was using some helpers to move machinery around. Now I will use helpers on the fields um, because I can do more in the same amount of time when I have helpers doing some of the work and I'm doing some of the work. Um, however, I, I stopped to use the helpers to move my machinery around and do my deliveries and that, that, kind, of, uh, that kind of work. Uh, how do I want to approach this field? We'll just go right from here. Uh, because, it, anyway, I stopped to use the helpers for that kind of work because it does cut down on the um, money I'm making or adds an expense. And uh, I don't want to... Uh, let's back up. And I don't want to, I think I cannot. Nope, no straw for canola. 
Um, all right, let's hire a helper for this. Pop in the cab to quiet it down a little bit. Um, yeah, so I don't want to pay the extra for the helpers to move my stuff around right now. I am willing to pay them for field work, um, like we're doing right now. So I, I drive with the automatic transmission, <laughs> but I like to uh, modulate the gas pedal in order to give me a sound of shifting gears. Anyway, we'll stage this trailer down here. Apparently I got a little bit of landscaping that needs to get done. Anyway, I'm going to bring this guy over and I'm going to stage him right here for now. All right, let's hop over here. I've got the uh, Lizard V8 in here. It sounds pretty good. I kind of want to try the other engines. All right, let's cruise back. So sometimes I like to stay outside the car so I can hear the engine. Here we've got almost no sound. <laughs> nice view. <laughs> but here I can hear the engine sound better. Oh, 75 miles an hour. We're already back. Mike, was at the shop? I could have just done this at the shop. All right, so I didn't get the mobile mechanic ramps. But the reason uh, let's learn how to drive. The reason is is I got this little mechanic set up right here. I want to hear how this engine sounds. Oh, it's $200. I don't need to check that out right now. All right. I always wanted a El Camino or a, whoa, I'm trying to wreck it. I always wanted an El Camino or a Ranchero. I think we're going to park you. Well, we got you out. Park you right here. That's a good sound, though. I don't know. I like how the door opens and closes on it. What are we doing over here? When did we change fields? No, 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 no. Somebody's drinking on the job. I didn't want to do this field in this order. There we go. 